Audio 123. Video 123. Streaming banner thingy off. Hello and welcome to the stream. Um, today we're actually going to be doing something that is uh, not going to help you any, of course. Um, it's going to be something that looks like it's going to help me, but it's actually not going to help me because that is the uh, goal, of course, is not to help anyone, including myself, but I can pretend it's going to help me. Uh, so before we talk about that, I do need to mention we are still in a war zone. We are in day three of the war between New Mexico and the United States. Um, hopefully they will soon realize that we're actually a part of the United States, but whatever. So if you do hear any uh, screaming or yelling or shots or whatever, that is, that's why that's happening. Um, I have told them to send the wounded to me, but I think um, they've been doing that for the last couple of days. And apparently I'm supposed to treat the wounded, not laugh in their face. So I don't think they'll be sending me any more wounded today. Um, <coughs> And the, the, the wounded that they've sent me are in my basement, and most of them are dead, so it's not really a big deal. Okay, so what we're going to do today is I've been talking about uh, creating a, um, a, a game that's played on a real-life world map uh, since I was very young. <laughs> Mommy, one day I'm going to make a game that's played on the real world map. Uh, if you're going to call me uh, Mommy, sweetie, uh, it's a 20 bucks extra, you know what I'm saying? Girl got girl to pay the rent. That really didn't come out as well as I thought it would. I didn't do my hooker accent quite the way I wanted it. Now, of course, when I was, uh, when I was younger, the, uh, the world was flat, and uh, we hadn't really discovered the Americas yet, uh, North America, Central America, and South America. Uh, and I'm pretty sure Central America is just really just a bridge between North and South America. I don't think it really exists. Now, the world is still flat, of course, as we can see by going to our uh, favorite site uh, for flat world maps, OpenStreetMap. Now, Google has uh, started creating maps uh, inaccurate maps that may depict the world as a sphere, uh, but that's because they're part of that conspiracy uh, to uh, make the world look... How do we get rid of this stupid... I think I had this problem last time, too. Um, so, hang on one sec. Um, I have to tell this person I am currently streaming. But you are welcome to join. Everyone is welcome to join. Text or voice, because I like this guy. Okay, so I think we had this problem before with OpenStreetMaps, is you can't get rid of this stupid piece of shit. Maybe if you search some... Oh, Europe. Let's find out where Europe is. I've always wondered. Where is the country of Europe? God damn it. Is this on purpose? Maybe... Oh, okay. Oh, fucking shit wads. I mean, I do have one, but... Uh, I shouldn't have to log in to use OpenStreetMaps. Motherfuckers. Okay. Anyway. This is really annoying, actually. I don't know if it's on purpose. I mean, I mean assholes on purpose, or this is just like their way of preventing people from using it without logging in, which they should not be doing. Um, okay. We're zooming out of Germany. We're zooming out of what I think is called Europe. And there it is. The world is very flat, and it does repeat itself at intervals. But as you can see, the world is very flat. Uh, this is not an actually a cylindrical map, meaning each degree of latitude and longitude does not take up the same amount of space. I actually think each degree of longitude does take up the same amount of space, which is not the way the real world works. Uh, this is a Mercator map, so, you know, Antarctica is huge, Greenland is huge, which, by the way, is true. I mean, the people in Greenland have been discriminated against for a long time. People saying, you know, Australia is the smallest continent, Greenland is the largest island. No, you can clearly see that Greenland is much bigger than Australia. Um, but we're not going to do anything about that. Um, so we're not going to be doing anything about that because... It's true, or whatever, or we, we don't care about the, Gren the Greenwich, pe the, the Greenland people who are different from the Greenwich people. Uh, Greenland, of course, is a, a dependency of Denmark. Uh, Denmark is so small, it's not even on the map anymore. Uh, it's in here somewhere, I think. Um, so again, the, the, the people there are called the Nunat people, uh, and I knew not what to do with them. <laughs> yes, there's a uh, racially offensive pun that only offends a very small number of people who probably, actually they might have internet access in Thule, Greenland, or uh, they call it Konaga, uh, the capital of Greenland, uh, quasi-capital of Greenland. 
Okay. So this is pretty much bullshit so far. I'm happy. Uh, now the weird thing is I think I do actually have a readme for this, but it's not geared towards um, it's not geared towards creating an ad. The readme is just really oh, which is much more complete now. Well, is it? So direct me to do something else always. Uh, okay. And we're gonna have to pull information from the. Wait. Oh, sorry. It's just read me. Um. Okay. So, Jesus freaking Christ. Yep, there is more data here. Okay. So let's go ahead and go to back to read me. Yamak, by the way, is yet another mule clone. Y A M C. So it's a it's an abbreviation inside of an abbreviation. Ha! <laughs> I'm so funny. Okay. So let's do this. This is the backstory. Actually, this backstory may not be used anymore um, because we're changing a lot of stuff. And the idea, we're now focusing more on um, on playing on a real world map than what the game the game mechanics actually are. So let's go ahead and call this a new file. Read me Yamak, your mama. Uh, add. Yeah, add should be good enough. Okay. So again, as always, we're going to start off with what we're going, what we want to put in this ad, uh, and then I'm going to come up with a speech for the ad. I'm going to speak it out. The ad will be performed live here on this stream, and then I will clip it out if it comes out okay, and put it up on YouTube as a separate uh, video. So this video, of course, the whole thing is also going on 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 YouTube. So really, a little bit of extra action here in the sense that I'm putting up two useless videos on YouTube instead of just one as I normally do or on days where I stream more than one time, you know, this is pretty exciting. So let's, let's get started. So the, um, so let's, let's, you know, let's start with we, what data do we have on the world that we want to use? Um, and, and we need to actually be able to show it on the stream as we do it. Blah, blah, I'm pretty sure this is not, this is the one I don't want. Read me maps, this one, there we go. Oh God. Uh, mineral whores and deposits, okay. Um, raster to piece. Okay, so what, what do we have? Elevation and steepness, which is actually n is the derivative of elevation, but it's it's not really because our elevation data is too blah, blah, is too uh, n rastery, too pixely. Um, um, so I'm trying to find out what we have here. Uh, SRTM one. Uh, which is very tight. I mean, it's not. Uh, there's more tight data here, uh, but we don't want to brag about the technical specs for right now. We want to do something that's kind of glossy. Um, let me see if I can get an elevation height map. Uh, even though this SRTM one, I'm almost sure. Well, actually, we we might. I don't know if they have maps there because that's not really their goal. Is not to create maps. Their goal is to um, let you download raw data. The maps are actually superfluous. Um, okay. Um, so this is this is an example. I might actually use this image. I kind of like this. Um, I'm trying to see if there's a um, data and tools. Um, and let's see. Oh yes, the Earth Explorer. That is a beautiful resource. That is a fantastic, and it's not even intended, by the way, to do what we're going to do with it. <laughs> um, yes, what do I want to see? We're in more in the Minnesota area. Let's let's see. Oh, let's go to the wonderful city of Albuquerque, New Mexico. And then, okay, that's good. And now, this is actually used to find data about it. So, data sets. Um, yeah. These data sets are actually more detailed, so I'm not sure if, um, unfortunately, this is not going to do what I want. This is not going to show elevation data. Actually, I think OpenStreetMaps will do that. Um, once they stop being fucktards. Um, actually, I think Google will do that. Let's don't want to use Google in the advertisement. We're going to use OSM, so let's make a note of that. Um, um, 
and it's open source. So we, wanna, we definitely want to mention that. I'm uh, going to be using OSM, JavaScript on the client side, uh, all accessible, accessible to all. Okay, Perl on the server side, but, but very limited just to fetch data. We're not going to do a lot of the work on the server side uh, and maybe to store user position data, etc. Um, but we're not going to really be relying heavily on the server to do anything except send us chunks of data that we need. Uh, so let's see. Um, let's see. Google Elevation Map. And do I actually want to, you know what, I'm going to try to do Open Street Elevation Map. Okay. OSM does not carry elevation data. Um, okay. So this actually tells us, of course, that, uh, oh good, finally. Um, features, no. I think this is what I want, right? Contours? Relief is the, yeah, con the contours will give us something, nothing. Contours will give us nothing. Um, Now, a little bit of a disappointment here is, of course, now we do know in America that we are the only country that exists. Um, but some people in other, uh, you know, what they believe that they live outside of America. Um, so we probably need to um, cater to them a little bit. So let's try to find a world elevation map. Uh, open cycle map. No, nope, no, nope, close you. How do I, you people are really fucked fuck heads about letting people um, um, Thunder Forest might be what I'm looking for apps for your apps landscape's not quite what we want though spinal map oh I get it spinal tap spinal map it's funny Okay. Let's take a look at it. Do not put crap. Oh, god damn it. Demo. Yes, that's what I want. Please tell me I can actually demo in this demo. Yes. Okay, good. Now, can I get. Can I change features in this demo? I cannot. Um. Oh, I'm scrolling down the map. Okay. What is wrong with these fucktards? It is Pomodoro time, but it's the first one, so I'm going to skip it. Um. Okay, let's go ahead and get this, uh... Ooh la la! Now can I get Yes! Finally! A way to get rid of this piece of shit. Um... Hoden, hoden, hoden! Heil Hitler! I, I agreed to everything. Okay, um... So I think we should be able to... Um... There should be an English version of this. There should be an English version of everything. I don't mean should as in... I can't find it. I mean, morally, there should be an in, uh, uh, English version of everything. But let's see. Um, I'm trying to turn off and on the borders. Oh, my God. That's bad. Uh, position mark. Oh, mark your position. Karten Vugen. Yeah. Goddamn Germans. Oh, and this is even their home page. They, they definitely need an English thing there. Okay. So, kind of, uh, we're stymied. We could certainly create our own uh, and dis you know, display it just to say, look, we can do it too. We, we know how. Um, and I could even go to the Discord and ask them, but they're, they tend to be open elevation. That's, yes. They think that closed that down, though. I think that, that doesn't work anymore. Uh, oh, it does. Uh, okay. Let's see if we can find some maps here. Um, but they do not actually give us a map with that data on it. Okay. 
Ooh. Shiny. Um. Oh, but I can you overlay these tiles on existing maps? Um. Okay, we have a at least this is a larger list of things that will fail for us. Um. It doesn't appear to be like a world map. Oh, here we go. Rolade spells relief. That's an old ad that probably doesn't uh, apply anymore. Um, oh my god. Okay. Go suck yourself, go suck yourself. What is relief? What the? We're fucking. I want to see it. This better not be fucking um, app only. Oh, you sons of whores. Oh, here we go. Sorry. They're still sons of whores. But no. Shit. God damn it. Um, oh, here we go. I, I do. I say that as though the next one's going to work, even though every other one has failed. Uh, I actually want to go there. I think we can just say Mac.com here. That is... Uh, Normally how we get to stuff, and of course I'm wrong because they have chosen a, well, probably not chosen. Um, come on, they must have a site. Oh, fuck, I did the thing I did again, which is, ah, fuck me. Which is, I didn't open it in a new window. Okay. No? What the hell? I don't want that. What the fuck? Show me some maps, you cocksuckers. I've made the uh, stream set to mature only, so I'm not being very mature, but um, I can curse more now. I, I feel I have to curse more now. Oh, God damn it. Someone needs to have these people beaten severely. And yes, I'm not joking. Um, of course, all of these are actually intended uh, to help people map. They're not actually maps themselves. Um, yeah, actually, um, the um, uh, fuck. Okay, so I've kind of burned a lot of time on on something that doesn't work. Uh, which is, which is good, which is good. Let's actually look at some of the other things that I have that I know do work. Um, uh, climate data, which I got from the Copen Copenhagen Institute of, no, uh, let's see. Uh, this should probably tell me, um, where I got the climate. It should tell me tons of shit. There is an other climate, um, Okay, Let's, can we find where we put it? Where we put it? Um, we don't have sources here. That I'm not happy about that. Let's let me check real quick. Um, okay, oh, that's wealth data. We might want to add that. Oh. Yeah, I, I get the feeling this is still not going to do what we want, but this is where the data came from. Um, and it's, it's freaking huge. Um, so we probably do want to, um, mention these guys because they are important. Um, I don't think they have a real, um, I don't think they have a real mapping page though, but that might be okay. Um... And they also might just suck. Uh, we need a little bit more space here. Okay, okay, so we can see the bottom of the browser. Okay, so this is, this is probably okay. Uh, so that is one data URL we do have. Uh, and we want to mention. Coastal distance, we probably, we have it, we're not going to use it. Um, what I need help with, which is not what people are interested in. Um... I am unhappy that I do not have the um, 
I think I just said that though, that I do not have the URL data, which I should. Uh, so we're going to search for Copen spelled this way because Germans don't know how to spell. Read me, client. Okay, good. Um, I'm pretty sure OL is just a like, open layers, so it's not. I don't even know if we need it anymore. Okay, so I'm not happy. Um, well, actually, let me do a quick check of something. I think maybe Geiger is an easier word to search for. Um, climate legend. Okay, that's okay. That's that's actually the raw legend from what they're sending us uh, from the site that I downloaded it from, which I no longer remember. Oh, shiny! Shiny, shiny, shiny. Um, does this have a URL? Nope, it does not. Let's see what does have a URL in here. This is kind of sucky. Okay, that was too much. Um, is it climate? That's how I store the climate data. Oh, that's it. The one place climate appears. Okay. Um, I get the feeling this, I do have, I do have where I have this data, I think. Um, cool. Let's get a little bit deeper here. Um, all right. Suck, suck, suck. Um... I know where I got it, and I don't want to kind of guess on Google, because, I mean, there's a source that I used, um, and I want to make it clear that I used that source. Uh, where that source is, apparently, I don't know. Oh, you know what? I do know. Hang on. It's on my other freaking machine, um, because... <sighs> I don't know why. Because I like putting stuff in places that it will never, um, never ever be used. So let's see what this is. Okay, so we have, um, all right, um, okay. And unfortunately, because I cannot transfer stuff easily between these two, I will go ahead and, um, create a little temp file here so I can get the data we need um, and we'll call it in temp transfer that's a good name for it all right so I'm gonna paste in some URLs um, that we're gonna use to um, advertise quote unquote um, and we're gonna get like close on some of this stuff without quite getting there but that's okay. We can find what we need from these. Okay. Um, let me see if there's anything else I can find before I return to uh, what, talking to you wonderful people. I do not love you wonderful people. All right. All righty. So let's go to temp, transfer. Um, yeah, I think we can transfer all this data over here. Okay. So let's uh, start. This is SRTM. This is the uh, this is the Copenhagen climate data, and we will want this to work. So let's go ahead and make yeah this we've already gotten as a URL, and we want to make sure that we're looking at the exact URLs and we can bring them up fairly quickly, or we have network issues and can never go anywhere. That's the other possibility. Um, let's go ahead and see this. I'm pretty sure this is la uh, land cover data, but let's find out. I have no fucking idea. Okay. Socio... Oh, actually it's not. Um, I need to be one... Hey, <laughs> global pesticide grids. I think this is where I found the population data, but let's, let's take a quick look here. Um... Okay, pop grid. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Pop grid is the population grid. That is, we want to be inside of that. We don't want to be at this main page here. Um, highlight. There we go. 
and I didn't realize that it's uh, opopera.org. This is good. We're actually going to find uh, quite a few sites that fail today. That's always helpful. Oh, I guess, oh, sorry, is that where we are? Sorry, it's the other one that's taking forever. Okay. There we go. Blah, 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 who cares? God damn it. No, I don't want data providers. I want the freaking thingy. Okay, we do not want this. Um, explore data. Okay. There we go. This is what we actually want. Um, I'm using GPW, I actually say it in the other file, um, but it's very, very, um, we don't need that anymore. Um, oh, I'm in the wrong one, still. Population count, revision 11, yeah, this is the one. Um, that's revision 10. We should have a revision 11 here, but we do not. But this should be good enough. Um, yes, how do I actually... Oh. Okay, no. How do I actually bring this map out? You know, actually... This is full screen. But yep, this is what I didn't want. But it actually doesn't look too bad. Um, this tells you the population density. What the hell? Why can't I zoom out from there? Is this too, too, is this the most zoomed out I can get? That's actually not too bad. Okay, so we're going to have the population density data without anybody being... Okay. So really quite a bit of failure here right now. Um, because I really don't want to do it this way, and apparently I cannot overview comparison. What the? Can I just go to this thing? No, apparently I cannot. Just amazingly bad. I mean, it's not like they're going out of their way to present data that cannot be used. Whoa, that is unacceptable. You must, you must tell us where the Copenhagen data is. All right. Oh, motherfucker. God damn it. The internet sucks, just in case anyone wants to, wants to, uh... <sighs> if anyone wants to join the internet and hasn't already, it sucks. You old people that I've been telling you the internet is wonderful, I lied. It is not wonderful, it sucks. Okay, let's actually go to something where I have something built, and maybe we can go from there. And really, what the fuck is your problem? Seriously. Why can't I bring this up full scale without having to go fucking... Uh, oh, zoom out. Okay. Just really, what the fuck is wrong with you? This is not a good viewer. This is a very sucky viewer. Now, the only th reason that they could sort of say is we, we're not really there to make maps. Oh, God. Uh, we're there to give data, which, which is actually true. I mean, that, that, is, um, that is correct. Oh, I know what I'm kind of doing wrong. Um, yes, okay. Uh, yeah, I actually have some of this data here as ping files or GIF files. Okay, or, or not here, you know, some, somewhere in the world. Really? Oh, this might be inside of server. Or Yamak server. Alright, let's see what we're doing. 
Okay. This is not cool. I definitely had maps somewhere. I... Oh. I'm sure there's some third directory. Oh, I know. I think I know where they are, actually. I think... Oh, here it is. ESSI. There should be a... Um, nothing here. Um, cool. There should be a TIFF file here, but I'm wondering if it went somewhere else. And it's not that big, so I definitely did put it into um, into Git. Let's, maybe it's over here. Let's just... Yep. Yep. Okay. So I clearly have data somewhere that I can't find, uh, which is normal. Um, I know I have it on the Digital Ocean machine uh, because I explicitly put it there. And you can actually, we can actually, ooh, 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 ooh. we also have it in GitHub Pages. So is this going to be like in Pages? Or, sorry, did I say GitHub Pages? I think I meant GitHub Pages, didn't I? Okay, oh, actually this is going to be nothing. <sighs> oh, BC Git Pages, all right. Okay, that's fine. Um, do I not have these here? Maybe. Hmm. Okay. I could have sworn I put them into Git because they're not that big and they're actually sort of useful to look at. And I remember calling them LCC East and LCC West. So give me a second, I'm going to try to find where the fuck I put this shit? Don't pardon my French. Okay. Okay, apparently I didn't put it anywhere. Um. Hmm. Okay. I'm almost sure I didn't do it as a GIF. Might have done it as a TIFF, probably not as a JPEG because that loses information. All right, I cannot find data that I had before. All right, let's let me quickly um, look for it even more aggressively. Um, see, this is the kind of stuff I could k k cut out of the video. Um, it is Pomodoro time. I'm going to go ahead and do it because I'm waiting for a grep. Back in two and two. Okay, we are almost back, and we are back. So, so far, okay, now I get the feeling of being, um, oh, what is it, uh, gaslighted, because I know I had these suckers somewhere. 
interesting, but they're not really that valuable. I mean, actually, I, I think I have them in, um, I think I have them backed up even over here. Um, holy crap. I do. Um, I have the data at least. Um, I have some other crap. Um, all right, I'm going to go ahead and use um, the greatest weapon in my arsenal. Uh, recall Q, which is a... Oh. Interesting. All right, and actually I will use another weapon in my arsenal, which is a weapon, of actual weapon. Uh, no. Let's see why I asked. Oh! Okay. I know what I'm, I, what I'm looking for is LCC West 1KM PNG. And that, okay. Why do we not have that? Okay, that should be in the Yamak Direct. Ah, uh, hello! Hello, hello, hello! Oh, hello, that's very cruel of you. This, by the way, is the wonderful person um, spent a lot of time with yesterday, not in person, obviously, um, but a wonderful person who was coding. Uh, we started out coding and we ended up talking about, um, well, lots of things that we probably won't. This is actually CentOS 7.2. It is not Fedora, it is, well, it's close to Fedora, CentOS 7.2, it's the bare minimum, and I've built up. No, for, this is not Fedora, this is not Fedora. Uh, do you want to go ahead and get on the Discord, too, since um, might as well go audio on this? Uh, if so, I will, I think I have, uh, actually, do you have my, I'm going to go ahead and give my name, but let's see. Um... Yeah, let's all wait for you. Oh, no, you're not shy. We were talking yesterday. You were on your own stream yesterday. Everybody go watch Where Is X's stream. She has a wonderful voice. Um, and she has four voices in our head, one of which is me, apparently. Um, but I'm glad you're here, actually. Um, we could talk about my... Uh, well, I am talking about my, um, my game. Um... We could also talk about, well, what do you want to talk about? You tell me. I can help you with coding. You can help me with coding. We can help the world with coding. And we can try to cure the coronavirus. Try to create a better virus. I'm listing out all possible options here. Well, you are shy now. You're even text shy a little bit. talk about oh that's right because you actually are learning Linux um, okay well the operating system is CentOS 7.2 which is a flavor of Linux uh, the GUI I'm using is X11 which is a very I'm not learning Linux I just use Linux that's a very weird thing to say um, okay Debian Ubuntu I've not heard of elementary OS but Again, th these are all Linux flavors, I'm sure. Um, so, I'm, and this is X11, which is the standard sort of display that comes with uh, Linux. In fact, it might be the only one, except when Mac OS X created theirs, they might have had a different one. I could be wrong about that, actually. Uh, Mac OS X may have also used an X11 server. Um, if you're doing stuff, I mean, they have like on their main machine, it's FreeBSD, but if you want to start up a X11 server, you can. So uh, I, I could be wrong, um, but anyway, this is so that's that's all we have so far. Now, if you want to ask questions or uh, hint, hint, get on the freaking stream in audio because no one likes hearing my voice, and they they'll kind of be forced to hear my voice with your voice because your voice is so lovely, they'll not want to miss it. So you'll kind of like average me out a little bit there. There is a four second delay for your convenience and comfort. Actually, I don't know why there's a four-second delay. I can't imagine that Twitch looks through every piece of data that's being streamed and in that four seconds can determine whether to do something about it. Um, like, they have a seven-second delay for television, I think, now. Um, but uh, but uh, but Twitch doesn't seem like it would have that... 
um, would have that feature. I'm going to try to get into your... Um, Do I have your? I, I'm in your Twitch. I'm in your Discord server, but um, let me go bother you there if I can find you. Uh, what's the name of your? God damn it! I joined too many freaking uh, servers. Okay. Uh, tell you what, I'll wait for you to get back to me. Uh, I assume you have uh, taken a break or died or whatever. It doesn't really matter to me. We'll just go back over here, and now, according to my records, I should have some ping files here. There we go. And these, and I shouldn't use S, yeah, I'll use Faye. Um, this is not going to be... Okay, uh, that's not cool. The only thing I can think of is this window is for some reason not logged in, but I mean... Yeah, okay. Um, or I've got a bad connection going. Let's try that one more time. Alright. When in doubt, use another browser. Oh. It might be the size of this is, is getting to fade, but it shouldn't, actually. Um... And there we have the wonderful land coverage, land usage data. Uh, it doesn't really mean much right now because um, we don't know what the legend is, but we, that we can fix. That we can fix. So, um, and I think I actually want to bring this up in display because I do want to zoom around it to show how, res how high resolution it is. Um, of course, that will also completely break everything in the universe. But, you know, that's the price you pay. Um, wow, I wasn't kidding when I said it would break everything in the universe. Okay. Oh, that's, that's not really very good panning there, is it? Wow. Things are really sucking it up today. Yeah, this. Now, Faye does let you do zooming, but unfortunately, apparently, it doesn't like these files. Let's see if it likes any of these files. Okay. Oh, this was actually like a flowchart I was going to do um, for something, but it doesn't work anymore. Okay. All right. It's not happy with this shit. Okay. Ah. Uh, and display do is happy with it, but it doesn't really, it doesn't really let you scroll. I could, of course, bring up, I don't think I have GIMP. That should be, yeah. I could have brought up GIMP if I had it. Uh, you know, we might be able to use XV and then... Uh, yeah, these are these are pretty chunky. These are pretty chunky uh, files. That's the data resolution there, by the way, forty-three thousand two hundred by twenty-one six hundred. Um, we might be able to get away with using. Um, okay, reduced should be actually. I don't think it's reduced, man. Okay, so let's let's have this. The only freaking thing that'll bring it up. It's kind of nice. Um, it looks really pixelated, which is not good because people will incorrectly assume that it is actually the data is not very high resolution. But I'm pretty sure that's not true because we can come on. Yeah, this machine hates me. Delete, we don't... No cropo! Actually, maybe we can use this. Hang on. Now, th these things are supposed to move it. Mm. Alright. And we 
want to show how much detail we have here. And actually, I think I know what's wrong. Uh, I think it's something I need to do actually here. Uh, crop. And then actually, I figured out a way to do this that doesn't require what we're doing. And then we could do max spec. And that should show us that we actually have data at some fairly high resolution here. However, it is not the thing we want to be showing off. We want to be showing off pages, this sucker, where it says bad map, because it is a bad map. Okay. Uh, oh yeah, OSM, we actually need to mention that we have OSM data. It's sort of obvious to us, but... Um, Oh, actually, okay, yeah. Um, we're going to use OSM here. Um, so an example would eat at restaurant to make it a game. Um, that would oh, that's the example we're going to use. Of course, you could also you know, say, well, you could buy a car here, get fuel here, do whatever the hell you want. Now, because of the uh, COVID situation, we could try to, you know, shoot this as a travel the world without going anywhere, but I'm not sure I want to take advantage of COVID that way because, you know, my good friend Bob COVID has pointed out, from its point of view, we humans are being pretty nasty to its, uh, to its children and its brothers and its siblings. So, so we do have a, a debt there to, uh, to, uh, to, uh, to COVID. Okay, so now what we want to do is time zones is probably not really that useful. Apparently neither is client. Oh shit! Did I delete that data? Oh, actually, let me see. I might have deleted that data because it doesn't look like it's showing up anymore. I am fucking brilliant. Did I delete this data too? Awesome. Um. The data we don't need. Okay, well I broke that too, so. Grid data we should be able to get, yeah. Um, so much badness has occurred here now. Um, I don't remember deleting the land use data because we. Oh, I may not have NGI NX running on my uh, on my machine on my DigitalOcean machine, which I can turn on. Um, but there's actually an, another problem here that we need to deal with. The the overlays that I have, you can't tell right now, are actually for a cylindrical map, and this is a Mercator map because it comes from OSM. So the lines don't quite line up the way they're supposed to. Um, so I'm kind of stuck here, uh, and I'm kind of, of course, I've kind of wanted to redo this for some time using a proper maps, in other words, uh, Mercator maps and Mercator data. Uh, so we could do both of those in in the same in the same um, in the same uh, projection, as it were. Um, apparently, our good friend Whereas X has just dropped in and left us, which is very sad. Um, okay. Okay. Um, so the original plan of yeah, I still really would like to show off the game. How do I do that? Do I just create a new JavaScript to show off the game? I mean, that that's kind of... We're asking people to help us with the work, but we're putting in the work to show them how to help us with the work. It's very cyclical. It's very recursive. Um, okay. <laughs> okay. By the way, this we can of course make this darker or in fact let's make this darker. I think OSM we're gonna go full darkness on it. Um let me go ahead and quickly and I do say quickly, log into the dig digital ocean server, which by the way is called Yamak for some reason. No, I because it's part of this project. That's why it's called Yamak. Okay, let's see if NGINX is running. It is not. System CTL. Start. NGINX. Start. I think that should do it. Nope. Start. NGINX. OK. 
Okay. Does look like it's running now. I don't know what the hell it's running with, but you know, that's always a guess. Um, at this point, I think I just need to do a shift reload. Uh, or, mm, it's, it's broken. Okay. Oh, right. Shift reload does that. Find it. Not looking good. Land use. All right. Let's quickly debug this. Um, where am I getting this open street map? Ah, uh, this should work actually. Let's see where this is. Pretty sure this points to the DigitalOcean server. Ah. Can I do this though? Oh man. Okay, so why is it forbidden? It is forbidden to speak of this. Let's see. I think I had this problem before and I fixed it, but I didn't fix it permanently. Which is, by the way, how you should always fix problems so they don't, uh, it's not, never permanent. And I think it's actually a permissions problem here. Um, it's also a problem of not knowing where the hell my, my root is. Let's take a quick look to see if I can find where my, I'm going to look in, you can't see what I'm doing. I'm looking at the conf file to see where my uh, web root is. In other words, where I have put the, oh, okay. So let's check the permissions on that sucker. Uh, they're owned by Nginx, and those permissions look okay. And I do have virtual directories turned on. Okay. This is awesome. Um, let me see if there's anything wrong with the, what the files that are in. They're also owned by, okay. Some of them are owned by the, the group root, but still by the user NGINX. So let's, I know you can't see what I'm doing and it kind of sucks for you, not for me. I'm gonna try to see what's, if I quickly debug um, why we're getting these errors. Permission denied. Uh, open dir. Okay, mount volume tiles permission. To, so that should not be an issue. Um, I think maybe I have oh, Pomodoro time. I want to take it this time back in two and two. Okay, we are almost back. And we are back. So I think the problem is one of the parent directories doesn't have read an uh, RX permission for Nginx, which is 
um, which is one reason you can't access a file, even though you could sort of uh, see ls minus ld. I know you can't see what I'm doing. That permission looks okay. Volume mount still looks okay. And then the directory. Okay, so they all look okay right now. Um, so permission failed. 13 permission denied. Um, all right, well, let's look that up. 13 permission denied. Um, and I think I've gone through this exact... Pro oh, hang on. I might have even gone through this exact process here. Um, whoa, why minus two? Um, seven, seven, five. Hmm. Uh, okay, seven, seven, five is a little bit weird. I usually do seven, five, five. But let me take a look. Oh, I don't really want to necessarily... I don't know if I want to necessarily uh, 775 these suckers. Hmm. Okay, I'm getting some no such father directory, but that, that part's okay. Server request get tiles no such file or directory. Let me actually try to get a specific tile. I mean, it, it won't work, but uh, it might help us to debug. Oh, come on. Really? Hang on. I know I have something like this. Okay. Let's see if that test thing is still in there, but... Yep, test.pl is in there, so... Let's take another look at that, uh, that error log. Um, upstream fast CGI host. So it did try to connect to the CGI. Um, Connection refused while connecting to upstream. So this is doing much worse things. Um, so this should just tell me, yep, not found. And that's not what's supposed to happen. Uh, oh, because I'm not, I should be doing virtual indexes though. So that's kind of weird. Um, all right, let's do... Oh, hang on. So let's do land use zero 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 dot ping, PNG. Again, I have very little hope for this to work. Forbidden. Okay, so that's a little bit different error. Uh, the same as we had before, but I think okay. Permission denied. Okay. Well, let me see what um, let me see what user. I know you can't see anything I'm doing. Uh, I'm gonna see what user nginx is running as. Uh, it should be running as the nginx user. It should be running as its own user. Um, but if it's not, yeah, it does appear to be doing. It's running as the main one's running as root, but the uh, the child is running as nginx, which is correct. So I'm gonna go ahead and I know you still can't see what I'm doing. I'm gonna go ahead and look at the permissions on the ownership and the permissions on all of this stuff. Um, it's pretty solid nginx here. It's pretty, pretty, uh, pretty, pretty good. Yep, they all look like they're owned by the right pers by the right entity. They all have read permission to the extent they need it. So I have no idea why this isn't working. Uh, but I get the feeling we've we solved this problem before. But I don't remember how we solved this problem before. Let me quickly look at the config file, which I actually, the config file I do have here, I think. Um, at least what the config file should be. This will be bc git um, server um, etsy nginx. Okay. 
I don't remember all of this crap being in here. Wait, did I change this to be a secure server? I mean, that should automatically redirect, though. I mean, that should not be the the killer issue here. Ugh. No, I don't want to... I want to... Okay. Well, at least we've... Oh, I want to... This may be... Okay. So it is actually... I probably need to do this. Okay, that didn't really work either. Um, no, so okay, hang on. Error. No, permission denied. Um, yeah, I'm not. Oh, well, let me check the permissions of the very root directory. That one I forgot about. Uh, it's, it's the way it should be. I, I guess the root should be able to write to its own directory, but that's probably not an issue. Uh, yeah, you know, that's kind of weird, actually, that we can't write. Let's go ahead and, I'll go ahead and do it. I, I know you can't see what I'm doing. Uh, chmod plus u for the root directory. So that we can write, I mean, we could anyway, because we're root, but, I don't know. Chamod seven five five for the root directory, please. That didn't. No, oh, that did give me seven five five. Okay. There's no way in hell that's going to fix this problem, but you know. Um. So I, I kind of want to do an su minus nginx to pretend that I'm the nginx user, but I don't know if I'm. It'll let me do that. Uh, this account is currently not available. Okay, that's full. Actually, let me do this. Let me become him and just run ls. Okay, that is... should not need a shell for that. Um, uh, let's see. Oh, here it is. It's minus command. So without even having to open a shell, I should be able to... God damn it, this account's currently not available. I mean, I could fix that too, but... Um, This is this is not nice. Um, and I, whew, it's an operating. I mean that that's really weird actually. I mean I could temporarily give an NGINX a password, but at some point I'm doing too much of this away from where you guys are. So uh, I guess we could SSH in from here. Uh, it'd be a little bit weird because I have to use a password from here. And let's see. So why am I not able to access... Do I have a home directory for NGN? I mean, it doesn't really matter, but... Okay. Is there, like, some sort of perm tool I could use? Maybe not. And... Okay, root. Owned by root. Group root. Everyone can read it, though. Mount. Uh, owned by root, da, 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 group root, same same issue. The volume that's mounted, uh, root root. Yep, still not too bad. Tiles, the directory that's the home server. Nginx, nginx. Okay, screw it. Uh, that's not going to work either. So we have uh, quite a few problems going on here. Um, so the goal was to create an ad for my maps project. Uh, but apparently, uh, I'm having problems with NGINX here, so, so that is not cool. Um, can I fix this problem? Uh, I mean, the, the error message makes it, like, pretty clear, permission denied. 
but I don't know if that's like the permission denied from it. Oh, you know what? Let's actually be a little bit more specific here. Um, let's. Okay, that's fine. Let's go there first. And then. Okay, clearly I've done this before. Um, da -da 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 -da. Oh fuck, SE Linux, that piece of shit. That is what I have forgotten. Let me make. Did I make a note of this before? I'm gonna feel really stupid if I made a note of this before, and just ignored it. Uh, so server read me. SE Linux. I did not. Okay. Um. Do I have a starting server section? Like I usually do, actually. Turn fucking, fucking SE Linux off. You don't really turn it off, you just set it to a different mode. Alright, so we're back in business. We're not really back in business. We have one um, possible... Um, way to look to so get in force and then I think the set in force will tell you what the options are so give me one second here get in force is enforcing set in force um, I think we can just do zero I mean, let me check okay apparently zero is permissive so then set enforce zero. Okay. That was a fucking piece of Linux security is so bad. Not the actual security, I mean the way they do it. So does this, yep. Uh, so, okay, don't need this, don't need this. Let's go back over here. Um, I wonder if this will, oh man. Okay. So now we can do these things, um, but the problem is going to be someone's going to say, "Well, what does this all mean?" I mean, these are these are all look very nice, um, but what does it all mean? So we can probably let's punch up the OSM date a little bit. Um, we can invigorate the climate data. So people are going to immediately ask, of course, you know, well, okay, great, what is this map telling us? What is the climate data that you're looking at? Um, and I'll say that's a good fucking question. Now you'll notice the edges don't quite line up and someone is going to notice that. Um, so I do need to mention it. Uh, uh, do I already have that? Um, oh, I do not have that mentioned. I thought I did, actually. Locator versus cylindrical. Not quite lining up. Okay, so now what I need to do is, this is actually pretty good, I need to find now the leg the keys for this, the legends or the keys, whatever you want to call them. I also need to close off all these stupid other windows that I have, including this one. Now nah, we'll leave this one alive. Okay. Um, and I should probably mention 43200 by 2600, because that's a really kind of a every um, one half minute, or a b well, we'll say about every kilometer or better. Because the Earth's res uh, the Earth's diameter is not quite forty three two hundred, um, it's like forty thousand ish. In fact, it's supposed to be exactly forty thousand because that's the way the meter was going to be defined originally, but it didn't work out. So, all right. So that's that's our data here. Um, and we probably, when we display it, we will want to go full on. Well, we might not. Uh, we're gonna go pretty close to full on, but not full on. Okay. Uh, the thing to get here is the legend for this data, which I think I also have somewhere. Uh, nowhere useful, by the way, but I... Um, climate data, climate data. <sighs> I don't even think it's going to be on the server, though. Okay. I'm using the same climate data. I think I'm using the same colors. Um... 
as the the source that I can no longer get to. Um, but let's see. I might be able to fudge a little bit um, by pointing out that we can. Pr I think most Copen uh, Geiger climate uh, data uses the same uh, index. Um, oh yeah, these are the guys that actually, these are the guys that need to connect to, and these are the guys that were giving me some trouble earlier. And we might be able to use a cache, but... Um, and we want the one that's a little more current. It's been changed somewhat recently. Wow. This is a pretty damn good data set. I want to I want to look at it. That's been that. Um Oh, is it going to Yeah, I think everybody's going to link to this site that no longer that the German people are I guess they're Austral uh they're Austrian, uh, not Australian. Uh, cuz it's um fucking hell. Because it is a dot .at so if you are in uh, Austria, please fix your internet. Uh, there should be, however, a page that does not, there we go, does not require, there we go. Uh, this doesn't actually explain, though, what the sub things mean. I should have a map of this somewhere. Uh, and the map is not the one we could use because Oh, the solar, I forgot about the solar map. Um, yep, definitely going to mention that. Okay. Um, the map I have is actually not that great because it, it's, it's sort of an indexed map. Um, that tells you what the colors mean, but it, the map is not like, you know, you can't really cylindrically resolve it. So let's go ahead and, uh, let's go ahead and look for Google Images, which is kind of what we want in the first place. And first hit, first, first hit. Um, I don't know, did I mean that? Pomodoro time, back in two and two. And we are almost back. And let me quickly check to see if anyone's trying to get a hold of me somewhere else. Of course they're not. And we're back. Okay, so I think this is going to be the image we want. I think I'm, I'm happy with the size, actually. Um, oh, no, the original image is from a place we can't... From the place that is not going to... Um, that's actually, I like this. This is pretty cool. 
Now please tell me it's a little bit small. Oh, and it's also a little bit climate changey. So I think I can just do yeah, this one's a little this one's too small to read the climate classifications and the colors that they use. Uh, now there's a way around this, by the way. You can actually in, in um, stop that. Uh, and you can actually do uh, tools, and you can actually ask for images that are large. Th there's a, there's actually you can do more than that. You can actually do you can specify motherfuckers. You used to be able to specify the exact resolution you needed minimally. God damn you fuckers. Well, maybe it's because I'm not logged in. Am I? I am logged in. Okay. Um. And I need one that has the legend, and the legend has to be big enough to be readable. Um. And g in, in a perfect world, we could even even have the legend that tells um. What what the climate class? <coughs> Excuse me what the climate ca classification actually means. Okay, hang on. Let me see if I can go to advanced search here somewhere. I think there's a way to... Um, I don't know if it's settings necessarily. God damn it! I'm trying to scroll to the right hand side. Safe search should be... Eh, I don't care. Um, where is, um, not secure search, I'm looking for, um, uh, details or, you know, search details, um, above and beyond this piece of shit. Um... Really, really, these these guys suck. So, okay, uh, search settings. Okay, I don't. Yep, this is not what I needed. I needed search settings for images specifically. Um, advanced search. There we go. Wine, wine, wine. Any size. There we go. Let's see if we can pump some up to like that. Should be more than enough to grab the. Um, To grab ones that are big enough to get the uh, to get the uh, legend data out of it. So hang on, let's see if we can do this. Okay, good. This is not from that stupid site that doesn't exist anymore. Oh yeah, this is what we need. Okay, this is good stuff. So we will crop this, but uh, world map Copen map, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. We probably will not be able to get a decoding of the uh, of the legend in anything that we we will use, um, because that takes up a lot of space, basically. So we will need to find <coughs> the decoding somewhere else, but don't think that's a huge deal. Let's find that. What happened? Okay, X. Let's actually copy that over to just legend.ping, and then we will xv legend.ping. I'm just joking, it's legend. Okay, and then what we can do here, we will of course get rid of the University of Melbourne, because everyone hates it. Um, I hope this is not their own, uh, like, little, you know, bullshit Australia, Australian-made uh, map. I'm hoping this is the one that I'm using. Because I am going to try crop. Showed it max. I didn't say max spec though. I said max size. Oh, that those keys are flipped now. Um. Oh, let's just do a save. I want to override. Okay. So now. 
we have this. This, of course, is not fully helpful. Because the letters don't mean anything, we might be able to copy down the uh, the Copenhagen. In fact, we should probably have that somewhere. Uh, yeah, somewhere in the um, maps data. I guess it's going to be in the Yamak data, actually. Um, I think it's called Climate Legend or something. I think we actually saw it. No, we did not. <sighs> Let me do a quick uh, search for something here on the other machine, which, which I know you can't see. Because I'm pretty sure we do have the file that gives us the legend. But I'm not sure if that's actually going to be... There it is, PC Git Maps. There we go. Oh yeah, this is actually kind of nice. This actually gives us... Oh, gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Yes. Um, so combining this with the legend, which I think I'm going to copy over here, I think it's really going to be quite useful to us. Yes. Between this and... I think we can get them both on the screen at the same time, even. Almost, but we can we can work on that. That's going to be a presentation issue, but I'm not too worried about that actually. Uh, and I think we we'll probably bring up an Emacs instead of in. Oh, Hang on one second. Nope, this is gonna, not going to work quite. Um, and the other big one, of course, is going to be land use, which I think I have the legend already. Um, um, already here. I think it's actually just ex it's just like legend or something. Um, it's like LCC something. X I think we already have this. Or we don't. I mean, you know, same thing. It's at the top level of the Yamak. This is, this is, this is why we love this shit. Um... I know I get a co- I, I mean, there's... Yep. Is it under... By the way, this actually, this node has multiple, this git has multiple branches. So it's really kind of weird that way. Uh, and as you can see, a lot of people, and we actually had, we were actually using it where um, different people were actually using it. We didn't really, we don't really understand it that well, but we did a little bit of stuff with it. Map tiles probably is not map tiles. That's not what I meant to do. Oh, wow. Hang on. What the freak? Okay. Apparently it is tiles. That's kind of cool. That's probably, I pushed these to di digital ocean, I think. I never knew I stuttered until I started streaming. Oh yeah, unlike Fey, um, XV will not let you, uh, there we go. Okay, this is pretty cool. We're not going to use this as part of the presentation, but again, this is, um, this is some fairly detailed data, and, uh, and we're going to get to solar in just a minute, which would be a little bit more exciting. That wasn't as exciting as I thought. Now that's better. Okay. Alrighty. So um, what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to find the LCC legend, which I guess we have not done yet. Um, and it bugs me because I know we have it. I could have sworn we had it here actually. Um, uh, why is there a temp dot? Oh god, I hope this isn't dirty. Oh, well, I guess you could see dirty things in it. Um, let's take a quick look here. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. Oh, here it is. Oh no, is that the one we just got today? Yeah, I think that's just the one we got today. Yep. 
I probably should have. Let, you know what? I haven't pushed this yet, so let's call it um, Climate Legend. PNG. And now let me go ahead and push this to get. Okay. And by the way, we could write programs to, for example, create little legends ourselves. Um, I do not remember doing that. I think I thought about it and I didn't do it, but but maybe. Um, anyway. So, okay, so we have this. Now we need to find the legend of for LCC, uh, which somehow has escaped us. Um, let me quickly take a look somewhere where you can't see, because that's what I like doing. Oh, it should actually be in the climate data. Hang on. So I don't know if I've linked that in yet, but no, I haven't. Let me go ahead and link that in. That's actually not. A bad thing to have linked in here. No backup. Earth data climate. And yeah, here we go. There we go. The only thing I'm worried about is does this expose anything? It shouldn't. I mean, this is just bullshit here, but uh, I'm gonna trust that there's nothing super bad being exposed here. Um, so let's go ahead and do that. Uh, Earth data, climate. Okay. So now we have some climate data here. And here I think we test image. Again, I, I fear that this is going to be really ugly. Test image.ping is. Okay, it's very small. But that's okay. We actually want. What is Beck? This worries me. Um, Legend Global. <gasps> okay, that is the wrong thing. But um, oh wow, I actually linked the wrong thing because we're looking for. Um, we have what we need for climate. Now we're looking for. Um, for land use, the only other thing I have on my on my little thingy here. That, that was kind of a waste of time. Um, LCC, of course, is what I mean by by land. Okay. Oh well, that probably doesn't hurt to to link that anyway. Um, now let me see if there's anything bad in the land use data. There, there obviously isn't going to be. Um, people I plan to kill. Oh, that doesn't belong there. Uh, oh my, there's a temp directory. Let's see what's in there. Nothing. It's empty. Alright, let me go ahead and link this sucker in too. Unless I've already done it, then I'm going to feel stupid. I have not. Good. Okay. Alright, my bad there. Let's go over here. There we go. Tons of crap here. Uh, what we're actually going to be doing, I think, I think this is actually the, the whole image dimension's too large, yeah. This is, um, this is a freaking large, this is very detailed, uh, but I think the, um, the what the hell? Lejandum, please. Um, uh, one problem is it's so easy to find the um, the legend. I <laughs> I keep forgetting. Um, what the hell? You definitely have PNG files here. Mm, is my image rep broken?
Oh fuck. It has to be egrep. Um, okay. And all of these files look way too big, except maybe this one. And nope. These look way too big to be le just legend files. Alrighty. Yeah. Nice. Not what we need. Okay. Let me go ahead and um That should be enough, yeah. Nope. A little bit too much. Um This is actually really good. Uh, this is the the text version of it, um, and there are a lot of of different um, uh, Chaparral. I don't even know what that is, but it's it's something in here somewhere. Nope, I'm in the wrong place. Ah, uh, Jesus Christ! I don't know why the word. Oh, this is just crap. Okay, so somewhere in here we should have um, the definition of each land use type. But we don't, unless we have it in Yamak, which actually might be more, might, might more uh, reasonable. <sighs> Fuck me. Uh, open layer? No, we don't have this, okay. Um... Except I know we do have it because I've used it. It has like, unless it's only over here. Well, that's exactly what I needed. Yep. This is the, um, this is how much of coverage we have. Uh, sparse vegetation. Uh, and there are 39 different land types here. And I also have that little legend for the 39 types somewhere. Although this looks like someone's actually added more uh, here, which is not cool. All right, give me a second. I'm going to try to find it on my other machine where it's easier to find stuff. But uh, lcckey.jpg. Okay, let me see where the hell that is and why I don't have it in a usable place. Oh, I do. Jesus fucking Christ. Okay, Pomodoro time. I'll be back in two and two. And we are almost back. And we're back. Kind of. There we are. Okay. Um, turns out I have it on my server. So it's going to be bc git bc info 3 uh, sites I have no idea where it is, but we're going to do this to cheat. And there it is. Okay. Um, and these are the uh, the defined uh, types and the colors that I'm using. 
um, on the map that I have. So, and obviously this would be in the game, this in the, could decide, uh, you know, what sort of stuff would grow where, although technically this is actually telling you how it's already used. I need to look at this at some point. Um, land, so, okay. So let me see if we can find out USGS land characteristics. I've never heard that before. Uh, I've heard land use and land cover. <whistles> now, you've got to be careful here because this is the national land cover database. We need a global one. Okay? Right at the moment after I said it. And I think this is the one I actually have. Um... Image dimensions, what? Okay. Okay, I hate PDFs, but let's go ahead and do this. Okay. So this is probably what we want to use, but I don't know how good... Let's see what they're doing here. Um, who we are, what we do, source data... God damn. A lot of stuff no one cares about. Um... Okay. Mm. All right. Let's let's see if we can download something here that we don't already have. Um. This, this does not sound like it's going to be very exciting. Yeah. This is tiny. Alright, so let's see if we have um, details. Land cover products and data sets. Land change monitoring. View all. Let's... okay. Products and data sets. Let's see what this gives us. Motherfucker. Fuck yourselves. Uh. Global, nope, that's just the instructions to how to use the piece of shit. Global README. Database version 2. Okay, fantastic. This is it. There's no fucking way this is it. Well, maybe it's this one that says land cover instead of products and data sets. I'm just guessing here now. What? The, it's not a search. What the hell is wrong with these people? Well, they work for the government. Um, and they also put a space between data and base. Um... So, okay, and maybe I'll look for the word download. Nope. Data. No Fear Act data. Nope, that's one... I clicked on that. All right. Oh, hang on, there was data and tools there. Yeah, let's do that. That's what I want. Um... This sounds interesting, though, not necessarily for me. Um, earthquakes, water, floods, geomagnetism, 
How can droughts be real time? Droughts are something that take a while to happen. But okay. We do not need that. API, science data catalog, science data sets. This is good shit. Uh, but I think that when you actually get there, it's going to be bad shit. Yeah. And it's not freaking... There's no way to filter for just global data sets. God fucking damn it. Um, this is probably not going to be helpful either. Yeah, the USGS tends to limit their se themselves to um, to the United States. I mean, that is how they are. I mean, that is technically we're the ones who are paying them. Um, ooh. What the fuck? APIs. APIs might be helpful here. Um, GIS data? Did we do that one? Okay, hang on, that might be, uh... Oh yeah, we did do this one, and we couldn't, uh, select topic. Ooh, hang on, this might be useful. Nope, there's no global. God, these people really suck. Um... Okay. They really should have some negative documentation saying we do not have global data on most stuff. So go fuck yourselves. All right. Uh, come on, we're global. They just hate the globe. Um. So anyway, that was going to be, uh, I, I guess, got lost in that. Um, so did we actually find what we were looking for here? Y and that's Copen, that's Climate. Uh, and I renamed it, actually. Um, so what we have here... Nope, we don't have it here because it is that. Okay, but we do have it. So let's go ahead and make a note of that. There's actually a better description of this somewhere um, that actually goes through what... And maybe I'm thinking of, like, land use or something, because there's, there's a very subtle difference between the two. Um, and I combine them here with land cover. So, um, or do I? Read me land use. That's nice, actually. Um, this, these are clearly my notes, by the way. Um, okay. It would be kind of nice to have some of this shit in. Um, actually, let's go ahead and get... Um, actually, let's copy this entire file. Now, if it's already there, I'm going to be pissed off. Okay. And let's copy this. Oh. I think we just want the legend. The legend lives... Oh, fucking hell. It's already there. Okay. I think there is another file here that is actually better uh, about the percentages would like be how much you could, uh, you know, how, how, uh, how much wood could you harvest from this tile would depend on how heavy of forestation you have. Um, and let's see. I'm gonna feel really stupid if land cover is a separate thing that I did, but let's let's see. Um, 
Let's find the smallest file. Let's find the smallest, smallest files here. One, two, three, five. It's always five. Um, okay. I'm trying to find a file that's small enough that it might actually represent useful information. Um, okay, that's really tiny. Oh, jeez. It's tiny, but it's images are... Okay, screw it. Um, yeah, let me check. Let me make sure that I don't have land cover separately from land data. No, I do not. Um, I'm looking quickly to see if I had done something stupid. Oh, USGS has its own little category there. Um, and that is something we do not need. Um, okay. All right. So I guess that's the best we have there. Um, yeah. There was somewhere that I saw something that had, um, just told you the percentages and types. It didn't tell you whether it was a broadleaf forest, evergreen forest, or all of that bullshit. Um, let me quickly see if I can find that on my other machine. Using Zapien. Um, okay, so I'm not really getting too excited about this anymore because it looks like, as cool as this looks, um, and the other thing we have to decide at some point is how, you know, how, what tile, you can't really be in the whole city of Albuquerque at once. I mean, unless you're freaking huge. Um, so the other question we would have to ask at some point, and we're going to run into a problem here, is, you know, what is the zoom level we're going to operate at? And the problem, by the way, here is if you zoom in a tile uh, too much, um, more than eight times, 256 times, it's not going to work. So the, we also are losing, um, we're also going to be losing some data. Okay. So, by the way, this is not where I live. This is just some place. So, I mean, maybe, okay, th this might be going too far. So maybe you could be in this tile and see all this crap here. And let's see what that is. Um... The 17th level tile. It is about 0.15 miles by... Oh, right, because this is a Mercator map. 1.45 miles. Um, and that's just this tile, by the way, not, not all the tiles. So, yeah, maybe you could... I, I guess I need to look at what the limits are of the uh, OSM API. We don't want to push it too much. Partly because they'll cut us off, and partly because we, we kind of want to be nice. We, we don't really need to know, you know, we just need to know sort of what's nearby the guy that's looking, we're looking at. Presumably, we can zoom out in the map and see other stuff, um, but we don't have to know every single detail of it. Uh, so there's, there's that. Okay, I've been going for almost two hours now, so unless someone shows up in chat to annoy me, please do, I will go ahead and call this a... Um, a stream, and I'm not very happy. Very unproductive stream, very unhappy, but we'll post it to YouTube because I do that. Thank you for watching, and goodbye for now.